I keep in mind that when I share a video, mm -hmm. I share with no expectations, mm -hmm. right? Understanding that of my friends, family, strangers, time is the most valuable thing any single person has in this mm -hmm. life. The following video is a part of a six part series with Anthony Bludgett, where we talk about the trials and tribulations of being a small creator. So if you're into this kind of thing, definitely give me a like, subscribe, hit the notification bell if you're so inclined. Here we go. Time is the most valuable thing any single person has in this mm -hmm. life. It's the most valuable asset. And yeah. who am I to expect someone to take 10 minutes of their life, five minutes, three, one minute of their life yeah. to give to me? Yeah. Right? So I have a responsibility to not clickbait, right? I'll flirt with the title, but I won't clickbait, right? Mm -hmm. I keep my pacing high because every second of your life is something you could be with your kids you could be with a friend it's you could, so true you know it's what I mean? so true yeah and it's like i i already have your view i already have your attention like let me respect that time and that's my goal with every single video i post is how do i tell this like story as fast as possible without feeling like i left anything that matters out and I think that's a good trait of any editor or content creator valuing other people's time and seeing the camera that I'm holding right now as people that you're you're interacting with mm -hmm. as opposed to a computer screen. Mm -hmm. One of the things I wanted to ask was the guy quit his job and he's pursuing content creation mm -hmm. full time, mm -hmm. much like your boy. Uh, what do you see as your biggest struggle right now? Oh man, getting fine like. To be honest, I haven't made money in eight months. Mm -hmm. So my biggest struggle right now is like keeping that faith, mm -hmm. understanding like I'm onto something, mm -hmm. you know, like I do have value. Mm -hmm. There's things I can refine. There's things I can do better, but that's anything, right? Yeah. Anything is like that. So at this point, it's just like staying true, staying true to course. Yep. Right. Like eight months in, it's scary, man. The bank account's getting low, <laughs> you know, like you got things you want to do. You don't want to miss out on like spending time and going and doing things with friends. But yeah, you, you have a dream, you have a vision. So you owe it to yourself to like chase that, man. Yeah. You owe it to yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, like who said that my life is worth $20 an hour? Mm -hmm. Who said that is worth $15 an hour? Like that to me, that blows my mind. To me, it, uh, it's, it's like that thought of when you get older, I don't want to have, I don't want to wake up one day and be like, oh man, I wonder what would happen if I would have done exactly. X, Y, and Z. And uh, to be honest, like just within the last like couple weeks of leaving my job, it's rough because the, the motivation to create and everything is like, a, it's a different concept. Before it was like, do the nine to five, go home, then just like stay up till like two in the morning mm -hmm. making the video yeah. uh, for the next whatever. Mm -hmm. But then I was just getting burnt out on yeah. uh, creating for other people and then creating for myself. Yeah. And then it was just like creation overload. Like I wasn't being creative. There's yeah. so much creativeness in that. Yeah. But, yeah. But, um, create, 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 create. Yeah, yeah. After like leaving and then creating for yourself, it's like you get up and then you want to like, oh man, I want to do this video. I want to do that video and I want to do this. So I don't know. I don't really know where I'm going with that, but I like it. Thank you for watching. I would love to hear your thoughts in the comments down below. Click the video in the middle for the next part in the series.